to try solving some practice problems here. Okay, let's try solving this one here first. If 0 0.05 equals z equals 1, then z, then what is z? So that is 0 0.05 z equals 1. To solve for z, we just divide both sides by the coefficient of z or the number besides z that is 0 0.05 okay. then this cancels out so our z is just equal to 1 over 0 0.05 or just z is equal to 20 so our answer here is 20 okay the next problem is if five apples cost two dollars, how much will five apples cost? So for five apples, it will cost you two dollars. And if you have 15 apples, so you have three of this one so you just have to divide 15 by 5 so you have three okay. three sets of five apples and then you multiply that by two dollars so the answer would be six dollars okay let's try more problems here Okay, four tons of gravel weighs how many pounds? So for one US ton, one US ton is just equal to 2,000 pounds. So that means four tons is just equal to four times 2,000 pounds. So that means 4 tons is just equal to 8,000 pounds. Okay, let's solve the next problem. If you invest $10,000 at an annual rate of 7%, how much interest will you earn after one year? So we just have to multiply ten thousand dollars by seven percent so it'll be seven percent of ten thousand dollars so we just have to convert um seven percent into decimal or we can write this as seven over one hundred or point zero seven so that is times ten thousand dollars so this would be equal to seventy thousand divided by one hundred so that would be seven hundred dollars so our answer would be seven hundred dollars okay let's try one more problem here so if the price of a gallon of gas increases from $3.20 to $3.68, what percent did it increase? So our original price is $3.20. Okay. Original price. And then new price is 3.68 so to solve for the percentage increase of the price we have to get the price increase first so we just have to subtract the new price maybe new price minus original price 
So it would be $3.68 minus $3.20. So $3.20. So that would be that would be forty-eight. Okay. Zero point forty-eight dollar. Then we divide this one by the original price and then multiply by 100 to get the percentage. So that would be um, 0 0.48 divided by 3.20 okay, times 100%. So what would that be? 0.48 divided by 3.20 so that is 0 0.15 times 100 percent so this is just equal to 15 percent so our answer here is 15 percent